nimeachiwa mtoe mm-hmm. saini one month two weeks huo mtoe notification zake zilirarudiwa mm-hmm. kitabu ya clinic hatuwezi mpeleka hata clinic for for injections jua tujua alifika wapi mm-hmm. and yani ime, imekuwa too challenging though mimi kitu naweza naweza show mwanzo wa kibera like tunaweza solve story kuliko tu solve na story za police case juni juni ko na OB pia mm-hmm. yeah so ni endi ataamua mm-hmm. because sasa mimi mtu wangu anaumia mimi si kwa ifanya hivi mungai na wamba kwa kwa sana Unaona wamba mwenye ame block hivi mungai huyu mwenye anajifanya ati ana apologize mm-hmm. ana apologize because she was paid to do it nani alimlipa Hello guys and welcome to Yvonne Magaya show. I want to say thank you for everyone who have subscribed. Lo in the building niko na Charlie Wakibera. Charlie Wakibera. Sasa niko poa labda Mimi naendelea poa Charlie Wakibera lakini sasa by the juice if you haven't seen my video kuna video nilikuwa nimeweka hapo ya Charlie Charlie Wakibera. Akiongea please go and uh, and see it. So Charlie Wakibera what is happening? Uh nimeachiwa mtoe sign in one month two weeks whom to e notification zake zilirarudiwa mm-hmm. kitabu ya clinic hatuwezi mpeleka hata clinic for for injections jua tujua alifika wapi mm-hmm. and yani ime, imekuwa too challenging sasa nikulize mimi sisi tumeona tu mkiwa poa na wambo mkaenda Mombasa kila kitu yuko poa ni nini ni, nini imefanyika hapa in between iki tu hivi hizi visanga zote zilianza aje uh, shida yangu na ambao ni miku manage watu wamba jetaka ni manage mtu ikoe demi kwe chali so sijui inakuangani anaona attention yangu ita shift ama sijai understand mm-hmm. ama sijui tu ni mtu self centered ikoe tu about yeye so hiyo ndio imeleta issue yote sasa huyu mtu huyu unyesema wako anataka ku manage mtu ulikuwa na manage nani apart from her ndio ikaanza kuleta issue actually nime drop around six people mm-hmm. because of her jude mo alikuwa ananiambia ni si manage mtu mm-hmm. the more yeye ndio nilikuwa na manage so ilifika mahali yeye ndio akakuwa analeta income mm-hmm. because mimi na deal na mambo ya industry na mambo ya fashion and shoes nini nini so nikitrai ku manage mtu ana boycott kwenda deals. Mm-hmm. Aki boycott mimi nafinyika inabidi ni drop mtu na try ku manage unaona. Mm-hmm. But one day nili, niliamka tu nikasema like for how long? For how long will I live like that? Mimi mtu niko na vision. Na mimi mtu nakuwa mkubwa. So kuna siku pia nataka retire from all this and niko na vision zangu. So anatumia mtoto kuni frustrate. Mm-hmm. Ataenda deals na jina nimemmekia. Atumi mtoto wangu ata shilingi. Sasa nikulize, huyu mm-hmm. mtoto alikuachiaje? Unajua wa Kenya bado. Unajua sisi tulichukia ndio huyo mtoto yuko. Hatukujua hata kulikuwa na mtoto. Mbona mlificha all that time sendo sasa mmeamua tunatoa huyu mtoto? <coughs> tulificha mtoto. <coughs> tulificha mtoto juu. Siko itakani expose mtoto wangu kwa industry but ukiona namleta ni juu sasa kwa life inafika ngamali lazima tu sasa u react because sasa kunyamaza isaidi ina make worse na mimi ndo nilikuwa naumia silently so i just come out na kila kitu ieleweke ina ikoe in public sasa huyu mtoto alikuachiaje hapa pia sielewi mlivurugana mkagombana akakuachia mtoto ama hao kuliandaaje what really happened hapo kwa kuachiwa mtoto After me kuendelea kuwa na watu nilikuwa na work nao siku moja alienda tu kwa shosho wangu akaacha mtoi akaacha manguo na akamwambia amerarua notification book za clinic hawa tuna manage wanisaidie kutafuta hizo document unaona mm-hmm. hiyo ndio kitu ile happen so sasa hii mtoto sa zingine ni mgonjwa yuko poa acha nasikia sasa anakoa sasa sasa hii inamaanisha uwezi mpeleka clinic Siezi tunampeleka usia anapewa dawa but mm. clinic wanasema kuna injections watoto upata na hiyo book <laughs> ndio inaonyesha progress mm-hmm. na mali amefika. Mhm. Mm. Sasa sahi nani anateke huyo mtoto? Ako wapi sahi kwa mkono nani? 
Umtoi ni kona e na shosho angu kuna anti angu pia. But umtoi sa zingine na kadei kia because sisi wote tunatoka man. Yeah. So ni ni nama. Though miki tuneza neza shamanzo akibera like. Tuneza solve this story kuliko to solve na stories za police kesi juni juni ko na obi pia mm-hmm. yeah so ni endi ataamua mm-hmm. because sasa mimi mtoi wangu anaumia and imefika mahali like siezi nyamaza enimo mm-hmm. yeah na sasa mbale hapo nikiongea na nilikuwa nimefanya interview na manzi wa kibera akaniambia ati mlikuwa na shida tu wewe ndio ulikuwa unafanya hizo cloud ulikuwa na mfos kufanya vitu zenye hataki but juu sasa ulikuwa ilikuwa like inaleta do inabidi afanye hadi wewe ndio ulifanya yeye na if mungai waka kosana unaweza uh, respond vile naweza respond mimi siko ifanya if mungai na wamba kwa kosana unaona wamba mwenye ame block if mungai huyu mwenye anajifanya ati ana apologize ana apologize because she was paid to do it nani alimlipa haya fan wake ndio alimlipa ha apologize huyu mm. fan alimwambia mimi nakupenda nilikujua sijui through if and I'm reconcile I'll surprise you and boom mimi naona ambao anajifanya hey, I'm sorry nini mm-hmm. how do you apologize to even dump your own kid mm-hmm. does it make sense kama uko na roho mzuri ya kusamea mbona ungesamea mtoto wako na si hata kumsamea huyu mtoto hajamkosea mm-hmm. it doesn't make any sense mimi hata sasa inaweza kupeleka kwa auntie yangu my cousins my grandma they will tell you mtoto ametupwa and it's been a month plus na mbona umekuwa kinyamazia pia juu uh, wambo amekuwa amekuja huku nje anakuchafulia jina but ni mbona tu umenyamaza tu sijaona ukirespond ukisema kitu mbona umekuwa kinyamaza all that time one month plus ndio sasa unaamua sasa ujitokeze ah uh, Wamba I think ali, ali, kitu ilimuma sana ni I chose my I chose my passion over her. Mm-hmm. Ju ali ali, ali a position like choose me or your passion. Mm-hmm. I chose my passion John it as idea watoto wangu. Mm-hmm. So many ni understand alikuwa frustrated and stuff but mali imefika we are no longer together and pay details on to you wangu. Kila mtu aende njia yake or I have the OB tupelekeshane mbele which na feel itakuwa kitu poa but ikifika mahali hiyo tu ndio option i love to do it mm. alafu pia hapo wambo alikuwa anasema alikuwa anakuwa accuse akisema kuna msichana atujui ni nani but alisema kuna msichana unalala naye mwenye yako under age ati hiyo ndio ilimkasirisha sana ni nini na happen huu ni nani ni nini na happen hebu niambie those are all lies hizo ni lies. Unaona mimi niko na mtoto hapa. Niko na OB. When when you accuse people of something, you come with evidence. Unaona? Mm-hmm. When you accuse hata me like wale watu wana believe vitu kaa hizo and there is no evidence. I make sense kwangu. Unaona? Na mimi siwezi to explain to anyone kwa ujinga zenye sijafanya. Mina wambo we are not together because I told her I'll be managing people. Mhm. Na yana niambia ti eh hey, I can't share my manager with people like who ni mtu grown up anaongea kama mtu aiban. Aya pia nikulize hapo tu. Mlianza hii kitu ya ku manage wambo. Ulianza ku manage wambo after shakwa wambo manzi wa kibera ama ulianza ku manage hata before. Ima hii hii jina manzi wa kibera ilianza wacha. Jina manzi wa kibera. Mm ni mimi nilikama hapo nayo jo mtu nilikuwa na manager na hiyo jina ali travel akaenda like job mm-hmm. na nikaambia dem since wewe unatoka kibera i think unaweza to me trademark unaona mm-hmm. so huu ni mtu nime manage from akipata akipost instagram inapata 15 views mpaka anambia eh 15 views kweli mpaka sasa anapata 2 million views tiktok i've been there So na mmekuwa mkidate all that time ama mmeanza ku date hapo katikati. Ah uh, tulianza ku date hapo katikati. Mhm. Mm. Guy, bye baby pole, mshike vizuri. 
So, um, sahi sasa wewe unataka nini kwa wambu? Nataka tu document za umtoto notification mm -hmm. na details za clinic. Mm -hmm. Jumto ya feel poa. Mm -hmm. Naombe mungu kitu isifanyike mtoyo wangu. Kuzi niko na obi. Aombe mungu sana kitu isifanyike umtoyo. Yani aombe sana isi, ya, isi muape nye. Na nikulize, pia wa Kenya wanashanga all this time. Cloud chase, unajua mmekua mkizwe mki cloud chase, unakuja unasema, hata wambu alikuja kasema, hizo vitu zote unilikuwa nafanya, sijua kiwa hosia, kiwa nini, ni cloud chasing, na wewe ndo ulikuwa na muambia, afanya hizo vitu, hata kama hataki. Sasa, wa Kenya wataamini aji saa hii, isi cloud chasing, tena munafanya? Wa Kenya wataamini, nisipopata documents, na wambu kwa behind bars. Mm -hmm. I think yon ditafanya wa amini. Juu ini life ya mtoyo wangu na staki kucheza na ayo. Unawana? Mm -hmm. Juu life, life si joke. Unawana? Mm -hmm. So, waamini wa siamini, wambo tuwa nipezo document. Juu wa sipo nipe, sita kwa na any other option. Maybe kwa nye vloggers itakuwa news ameshikwa, but kwangu it will be victory. Juu, I want justice for my kid. But autaki fike hapo? Staki fike hapo. Staki fike hapo. Kama ya naona amefika kwa sawa, mimi neza chukua mtu ina ni chukua watunda manage ni ngangane na... Mm -hmm. uh. Asa saiwena wambu, you don't talk anymore. Ama ushe jaribu kumreach out, ama kureach out family yake or anyone before uamuwe sasa chanende kwa media. Nime try kumreach out mara mingi sana. Na nasema ni? Ana niambia watunda manage wa nipeizo documents. Na nini lifanya dia kararua hizi documents? Badu sielewi, alikasirika, anararua aje, unasema anararua clinic, clinical card ya mtoi? Ya, yeah, na notification yake ya kupata birth certificate. Mm -hmm. uh, I think hiyendi ya nizajibu ya uswali. Juni mtu wata mi at some point nilidhani ya maa yuko normal. Mm -hmm. Unawana? Ya yeah, neza jibu yo swali. Aya, kwa hiyo video pia naona ulikume semati wambo suju anabeba kisu, suju anafanya nini. Ebu explain anabeba kisu aje. What was happening? Ok, unona mali nimefika. Like hata staki kuingilia hizo. Unona like staki kuingilia hizo. Mm -hmm. There is a lot, believe me. There is a lot. Mm -hmm. But at this point, achatua nipe hizo vitu. Mini I walk my way. Mm -hmm. uh. Sasa, last words kwa wambu kama na watch i Ebu muambie, muambie muongeleshe. Uh, kitu mine za msho, mtu wa kikuwelpu fike maali in life. Huh? Learn to be grateful. Unawana? Like, you can never take that from me. Unawana? Like, when she was busy sleeping... Mini likuwa busy niki brainstorm vile ata blow. Unawana? And another thing, atuko poa but don't take it out on this kid. Unawana? Umto ya jako say anything, mpatietu rights zake as a mom. Unawana? Mi ata siju chunga mto iju, mi siku mbeba for nine months. Ye, ye ndiyo sasa anafak, mimi ndiyo nafanifanyi hizi vitu anafanya. Unawana? And also, Ata travel la ende maju Kama ata make peace na umto hii I don't think it's going to work I don't think it will work Ata ya najua Like Anafata hizo document za umto hii alete Na apologize ya Kenyans For kitu wamefanya Things don't go away Because you ignore them You have to address them Lazima address this situation Ndiyo i go away. Unawana. Viva tu. Hey guys, mmesikia kama mko wapo nje wambo. Pia amesikia penye yako. Itabidi yata minende ni tafute wambo. Ape tu, ape mto hii right zake. U mto yaja mkosea. U mto yaja mkosea. Mine za kwa ni mkosea, but even do hiko watu udetu watu wachana. Unawana. Viva.
So tutaingia kwa hii story itabidi tena nitafute manzi wa Kibera ama vile anaitwa Wambo niende nijue ukweli kunaenda aje mbona ameamua kuacha mtoto na what really what is really happening to the Wakiberas guys i want to say thank you so much for being with me till the end till next time be kind to one another spread kindness wherever you are till next time bye guys